What's up guys, welcome to Apex, thanks for tuning in. Big news from Samsung, is the S Pen, that cool little stylus we have known for years, about to disappear? It's gone from the new Galaxy Z Fold 7 and people are wondering, what does this mean for our favorite S series phones? So, the new Galaxy Z Fold 7, no S Pen support at all. Samsung basically removed the special tech needed for it. Why? They wanted to make the phone super thin just 8.9 mm when folded and also make the screen tougher with stronger glass. Samsung calls this a trade-off. They gave up the S Pen for a slimmer, stronger phone. Samsung also said that not many people actually use the S Pen on older fold models, so it wasn't worth the cost and design hassle. But here is the thing, the S Pen for the fold was never built in like on other Samsung phones. You had to buy it separately and carry it in a big case which probably made people use it less. However, naturally, a lot of Fold users are pretty upset about this. Now, what about the Galaxy S Ultra series phones? Is the S Pen going away from those phones too? That is the question a lot of people have been asking and a lot of S Ultra fans are wondering about. Today, we still have the S Pen inside the Galaxy S25 Ultra model. But the S25 Ultra's S Pen did get a small change. Samsung took out the Bluetooth features like using it as a remote control for the camera. They said almost no one used these features so removing them helped make the phone a bit thinner and lighter. But all the main stuffs like writing, drawing and quick notes still works perfectly on the Galaxy S25 Ultra. Now looking ahead to the Galaxy S26 Ultra, there are whispers that the S Pen might change again. Samsung might remove the special screen layer it needs, possibly to add new features like magnetic charging or make the phone even thinner. If this happens, the S Pen might not be built into the phone anymore and you will have to carry it separately like with the older phone models. Samsung says removing the S Pen from the Z Fold 7 was a tough choice, a trade-off. They really want to make the phone super thin and light because that's what customers asked for and taking out the S Pen tech helped them do that. But here is the hopeful part. Samsung is working hard on new thinner S Pen tech. They are even looking into ways the S Pen could work without needing a special screen layer or even its own battery. Samsung says they will reconsider bringing the S Pen back to future fold phones if they can make it perfect and if enough people really want it. So the S Pen isn't really being abandoned, it is just changing. For the Galaxy Z Fold 7, it's gone because Samsung wanted a super thin and tough phone. They also saw low S Pen use on the older folds, probably because it wasn't built in and was a hassle to carry. But for the Galaxy S Ultra phones, the S Pen is still a big deal. It's built right in, perfect for notes and drawings. Even though the S25 Ultra's S Pen lost some Bluetooth tricks, it was to make the phone better overall. And for the S26 Ultra, Samsung may keep the S Pen or we might see a new kind of S Pen that's separate but still works. Maybe to increase the size of the battery, Samsung might remove the S Pen on the S26 series, S26 Ultra or on the S27 Ultra. And if that happens, it will be a heartbreak for a lot of Samsung Galaxy S Ultra phone users. Let me know what do you think about it. Do you think Samsung is going to remove the S Pen support in the future Galaxy S Ultra series phones? If not on the S26 Ultra, do you think they will remove it on the S27 Ultra? What are your thoughts? Share it in the comment section below. And do you have a Galaxy S Ultra phone? How often do you use S Pen on your device? Drop a comment and let me know. And while you do that, be sure to download our wallpaper application Wallverse. It's a fantastic app with tons of uh, free and premium wallpapers and we are also adding the live wallpapers on the application. Go ahead, check it out. The link is in the description. And while you do that, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Give this video a like. I would really appreciate that. Every like that you give for the video will take this video to many more people. So uh, go ahead, hit the like button. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one soon. Cheers. Bye-bye.